take out on, on, on a YouTube video, you know, just to entertain you guys or whatever. But would you hate Brandon Mitchell, long story short, would you hate Brandon Mitchell if he was gay <clears throat> and start turning your back on him and whatnot, all because you don't like a certain thing that he's done or whatever, or you don't like him because of a certain preference or whatever? So, obviously he's not gay, you know, he's, he's as straight as a pole, but once again, just an example. Uh, people who, you know, are usually, ter you know, can, can be on your side one day and then turn their back on you the next. It's, tr it's crazy, you know. But I am not here to condone any of this stuff, but I am in full support of Sean Phillips and MJ Kelly. And I want to use this as a video response because I feel the message has to be uh, told loud and clear. And there is no reason why any of you guys just start hating on MJ. He might have a sexual, you know, dream or destiny or, or craving. So do I, you know. So does Brendan. So does Sean Phillips. So does a lot of people. You know, we all have a certain craving or whatnot that we really, really want it, you know. I mean, I want it for a long time. You know, but, you know, you don't see me, you know, making a big deal about it, but we all have certain things that we want or certain, you know, you know, things that most people don't know about us or whatever, secrets or whatever, but who cares, okay? If MJ is a sexual uh, maniac, let him be one, you know, that's his own, that's his own uh, personal thing that he wants to be. Uh, but I, from what I've seen in the videos and even on their live stick camp chats, I don't think half that's true. I think he's a very decent guy who is just a young guy, just like us, just like me, just like Brendan, just like Sean, you know, who's just trying to get his stuff out there, you know. And never, he probably never thought, and neither than Sean ever thought that they'd be as successful as they had been, as far as their, not just on YouTube, but all the other stuff that they've done too, prior to YouTube. But you guys got to remember that they they were here for entertainment. They they are here not just to become popular or whatnot, but they're here to entertain us, and that's exactly what they do. All their videos always have a good point, whether it's a Randall the Town video, DVD update, Don Murphy episode, whatever. And there's a reason why they're successful. Okay, they they do work hard and they they have earned everything they've ever gotten. You know, like I said, I may have never met them in person. But just by watching the videos, I know exactly, it, it seems like I know them. It seems like I've known them for a long time. And they are responsible. They are, they are the only two guys who are responsible for getting me back in my old you know, love for the 80s and 90s. Whether that means anything or not, but actually means something, it's something special to me because I never thought I'd ever be, you know, I've always collected movies and whatnot, but I never thought I'd ever buy a merchandise or whatever. Those things actually mean something to me. I know it's maybe weird for a 26-year-old to have a, uh, a habit like that to actually have you know a feeling like that, but it, it means a lot to me. You know all the little collectibles and stuff, because you know they're right. I mean current times do kind of suck here and there. You know when people talk about the economy and global this, global that. You know stuff I could give a shit about, but you know it's nice to always dip your hand in the past and whatnot. And I have Sean MJ to thank for that, uh, and I'm sure there's a few others people have have them to thank for their success, or just because they've started doing DVD updates or whatever. So, long story short, I don't know how much time we got up here. Let's just keep this under at least 10 minutes anyway. Uh, just try to let you guys know that I am in full support of Sean and MJ and everything that they do, no matter if it's good or bad, you know, I don't care. They are good people, and I think uh, all you YouTube subscribers need to start uh, growing up a little bit and just let this thing be. And uh, that's pretty much all I'm going to say about it. So this is a little rant from Frankie here. Uh, so, so my love for Sean and MJ, cool duder. And Brennan, I'm sorry, that was just a little example. You know, obviously I know you're not gay. So whatever. <laughs> anyway, you guys take care, and we'll see you again for another great Frankie Slauson Show video. Rock on.